what is up with this crazy goalie here, bringing you some Rainbow Six Siege Operator's Guide. So today I'm going to be doing Twitch and Doc, so let's go ahead and get over to their gear. So Twitch has the ability to have a multitude of guns um, that... It's, it's kind of ridiculous of how many guns she actually has. It's about as much as, I think, um... What's his name? Uh, Mew? I think he has as well. I think he has three weapons. I can't remember. Anyways, let's go ahead and get this review started. So, her first assault, for her first weapon, is going to be the F2 assault rifle. It's basically kind of like a, almost like a FAMAS in a way. It's kind of nice. Um, it is very good. I personally like it. I have it with an ACOG, a grip, and a condenser or a compensator. I think it is. And then you also have the. 417 marksman rifle which is semi-automatic and very high powerful grip compensator and an ACOG and then of course the CG CQB shotgun so that's gonna be her main armament shotguns obviously for close range quarters F2 and then the 417 I personally like using the F2 for one reason um, I th think I actually have a silencer on the F2 correct me if I'm wrong here uh, no it is kind of Okay. But anyways, the um, F2 does a lot of damage and it has a very high recoil pattern, but it has an extremely fast fire rate. So let's go ahead and go on to our secondaries, which are going to be the P9 and the LFP586, which is a 357 Magnum revolver. Very high damage, a lot of penetration. Um, the six shots suck, though, because of the recoil pattern. Um, besides that, it's pretty good. She has for her gadgets or equipment, breaching charges, and a stun grenade. And the second person that we're going to be using is going to be Doc today, but let's go ahead and before I forget, go over her vid video and her special first. Her special is going to be the Erd SD Model 1 Shock Drone, which is a tasered shock drone that has like 15 total tasers on it. It's able to use to either injure enemies or disable traps, and I find it more useful to take out traps uh, than it. Oops, I went over to her details and statistics now while I use her um, as far as how good I am with her. So let's go ahead and go over her video. You have a few spare hours. I'd love to show the details of how this device is a masterpiece of design. Quadruple independent gearboxes enabling 0 to 20 in under 4 seconds. 10 kilometers of internal wiring, 1,100 expertly machined hand-assembled components, flawless control at over 300 meters. But all my team needs to know is, does it do the job or doesn't it? And let me tell you right now, it does the job. So it's basically a modified uh, drone as that we use in the beginning for reconnaissance. Um, that's basically what it is. Now let's go ahead and go over Doc. Doc is one of my favorite personally, and that's just my personal opinion. So let's go ahead and go over his loadout. He is also going to be having the CG CQB shotgun, 12 gauge, uh, gauge uh, pump action shotgun. Uh, I don't know if I remember mentioning that. And he has the MP5 um, and the P90. Personally, I don't like the P90. That's just my personal preference. I'd rather use the shotgun or the MP5 in any type of day and that's just me so secondaries are going to be the p9 and the 357 magnum revolver uh the gadgets are going to be the deployable shield and barbed wire it depends on how you want to play doc and what kind of environment he's playing in he can have a multitude of um usefulness uh i personally prefer the shield but currently i have equipped the barbed wire so Let's go ahead and go over his unique ability, which is a stem pistol, which is basically fires a hypodermic needle to either revive himself or a teammate from a distance when an operator is down. Basically, an easy way to get to your teammate from a farther amount of distance. Um, I don't know if you can even really see his uh, pistol on him. No, you can just see his uh, sidearm pistol, not the stem pistol. So he just kind of pulls it probably out of that little side pouch right there that's on the side right there. Um, let's go ahead and go over his video. I 
I've learned from experience that the place to save lives is in the field. Not an office. And sometimes, the only way to save a life is to take one. All right. So there's Doc. So let's go ahead and get out into a casual situation where we can use Doc and hopefully use um, Twitch as well. Alrighty. So it looks like we're on border playing a little bit of secure area. We're on attack at free, so we're going to go ahead and get to Twitch as fast as possible. Oh, mister. There we go. So we're going to go ahead and use her F2 uh, to begin right off the bat. Her P9 is going to be her sidearm and breach charges is going to be her gadget. Let's get this party started. In like five seconds. Better shoes. No. Comes the loading part. Okay, for loading. Boom, 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 boom. I'm loaded. Ready to go. Three of us are loaded. Got two more to go. What's their connection? 119 and 84. 84 should be next, and then Ash. Should be, unless they load up at the exact same time. We're about to find out. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, there's Blackbeard. Ash is next. Is there anyone higher than her? No. Oh, 141. Demon on the other team. What a ping rate. 141. Ping at 80. Hmm. <laughs> Wow. There we go. That took forever and a freaking day. And Find drum. The container location. So let's go ahead and find the biohazard container. Good work. The biohazard container has been located. Hmm, downstairs. Capcom. No, oh, that's Capcom. Ten seconds to insertion. There's Valkyrie roaming around. Five seconds before insertion. Get all the free points while I can. Why not? Biohazard container and secure it. Alrighty. Got a whole bunch of points there. Let's go ahead and throw a shark drone. Now the shock drone is basically a glorified recon drone. Uh, just the fact that it has tasers. We can basically use it for the exact same thing that it is already being used for. Um, reconning. Alright, I got two in there. Oh, he got me. Alright, I was hoping to be able to get to the... No way. Ooh, he got lucky. I guarantee that was a headshot. There was no way he could have beat me then. 
Oh yeah, headshot. Lucky. That's alright. Where are you going? Nice headshot there by Ash. Nitro. Ooh. Friendly last operator standing. Ash is the last one alive. They're about to crossfire anyways, that's alright. A PMM, very powerful sidearm. Extremely powerful actually. Alright, let's go ahead and get some dock in the action. Gonna go ahead and stick with the MP5, P9, and I'm gonna go with deployable shield. Ah, I left. I lost one. Looks like he didn't want to play anymore, or he was getting pissed off. Who knows? This timer takes forever. Uh, so we got Jaeger, Bandit, Pulse, Smoke, Me. Hmm. No one to really jam them up as far as uh, them not being able to figure out where we are, but... Hey, as long as Bandit can put his uh, things in the right area, they should be able to protect the objective. Um, yeah, that is if he does. I guarantee Pulse is going to be roaming, though. Pulse and Jaeger. I'll be staying right at the objective. That's Secure where... the room. Uh, we need to protect yes. the biohazard yes. container. Oh, Jesus. God damn it. That's the second time I've done that. Op 4 drone has found the biohazard container. Loading bag! Sorry about that, dude. I heard him. No way. Oh, he, he might have got lucky, but I swear I was able to fire a bullet off before. 
Oh, got him lucky again. These headshots today, man. I'm telling you. Has been compromised. If you remain in this zone, you will be detected by hostiles. If you are by hostiles, fall back. They are getting mad lucky. You have entered an enemy controlled area. Leave now. Op four eliminated. There we go. Successful. Nice, nice. We refeated that wall full of blood. Alright, on the third round for attacking. Let's go ahead and pick Twitch again. We're gonna go ahead and take out our 417. I personally like a 417 better, that's just me. Oh, goodness. Snap, crackle, and halt. Alright, we're all ready. That time we should go down. Here to three seconds here shortly. No? I guess not. Not. I just went from five to three. Great. Let's find out where they're at this time. Find the biohazard container location. It's one one. Not in the same area. Sounds like they're right in here though. Could have been wrong. That could have been upstairs. I was hearing. Might have been upstairs. Yeah, upstairs. Oh yeah, definitely upstairs. Good work. The biohazard container has been located. No, ah, I got me. <laughs> Ten seconds. Five seconds. Proceed to biohazard container location. What's her nuts was waiting? I really wish I could shut that damn thing off. Oh, no. Got my shock drum. Where the hell is that thing? camera there, but that's been taken out. Take that camera out too. Hostile activity. Resume securing the container once the threat is neutralized. Oh. Okay. Where was he? And how come I kind of kill him? Oh, that's why he's right there. Mm. Damn. Ooh, Jaeger held that down pretty well. I expected him to be inside that corner still. 
Usually they don't move from there. That's all right. Getting a good game here. All right. Uh, I'm going to keep with the MP5 for right now. I want to show off the um, shotgun, but not quite yet. Let's go ahead and keep the same loadout as I did last time. <sighs> Hopefully we don't have too many people roaming around. That way I can actually keep a guard on them. You know, that way if they go down, I can actually revive them and stuff like I'm supposed to be freaking doing. I know. I don't want to stay around the medic. That can help us get up. Barricade the room. We need to protect that the bio make too much logical sense. Sounds like a smoke alarm going off in a while. I knew what he wanted. I just had to figure it out. That way he can have more life and fight on, basically. further access to the biohazard container. Op 4 is securing the biohazard container. Intervene immediately. Protect the biohazard container. No, Jesus. I heard the crashing behind me and, you know, I don't fucking look. Of course not. How the hell did he get... Four remaining. Really? That Capcom trap didn't go off? What kind of bull crap is that? Wow, I really sucked that game. I really did suck. Holy shit. Alright. Let's go ahead and choose Twitch again. Let's hopefully we can actually use our 417 this time. Hopefully I won't have to worry about being too close in range. Of, um, my enemies may be a little bit longer distance with Twitch with our 417. That way I can get a better 
angle. I guess. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, two, two. Okay. I, I really have no idea how that guy got over that trap. I was there. Unless if you vault through a doorway that ha might have a trap on it. I can actually save you. you need to I don't know. The biohazard container. Something for a theory testing there a little bit. Second like floor again. I got Rook. They have Valkyrie. They have um, Pulse. Um, Frost. What is this? Is this Rook? That is Rook. Insertion in 10 seconds. Five seconds before insertion. And we proceed to the biohazard container and secure it. Get up here as fast as possible. Get in there. No. Nope. Try that again. Get in there. Hello. Nah. Too bad I can't drop a grenade down in there. That would be one. That would be one hell of a way to get down in there. That would be cool. Just poof, right through there and just drop down on them from above. That'd be cool. Anyways, uh, back to the objective. to do it. Though when they're spraying. Alright. Hard fought victory. That's the one way to do it. Two and four I sucked. Honestly. <laughs> the only person that really led their team was that guy right there. Unless the two people that left. Well. They were involved as well. So guys. Hope you got the little blah, blah, blah. Hope this Gave you a little bit more in-depth view of Twitch and Doc. That's a really long round there. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Really hard fought victory, especially right at the end. Next, we're going to be going over here. Um, after this, it's going to be the Spetnaz. Well, Montang and Rook, and then the Spetnaz. And then um, 
glass cop can, fuse tachanka, so on and so forth. So stay tuned for the next video, guys, and I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.